Hare Krishna, my name is Brihat Mridangadas. I am from Cape Town in South Africa. So why I like Mayapur a lot is because one reason is that it's in the center of Navadweep. So it's very easy to visit all these nine islands in Navadweep. So it said that all the sacred places, all the Tirtas are in Navadweep. And if you just do the Navi Parikram, it's like visiting all the holy places. So I like to do that a lot when I have the chance. You see, either go with the Parikram groups or I just go by myself visiting different islands. Another nice thing about Mayapur, the opportunity to study Prabhupada's books, to study the Shastras, just getting absorbed, and then also getting an incredible amount of mercy from the Dham, and then going back to South Africa and trying to share this mercy with the people and trying to inspire people to come and visit Mayapur. I think if people come to Mayapur, it will be very easy for them to become devotees. So Mayapur is a very merciful place. Mahaprabhu's mercy is very accessible here for anybody and all who comes. Also Mayapur is nice because it's very easy to meet devotees from around the world and to create very nice friendships with them sharing our experiences in Krishna consciousness and really um, relishing the association itself so also TOVP of course TOVP is amazing and that everybody's waiting anxiously for TOVP to be created and to be finished so there are many more facets of Mayapur that I like but I think that the legacy of Prabhupada that's being created there here um, is very much a testament of Prabhupada's greatness and it's a testimony of Prabhupada's incredible genius of how he wants to transform this whole planet into Krishna conscious planet. So I think it's also very inspiring for me to go and participate in this legacy and trying to preach by distributing his books and just being friendly with people whom I meet and trying to give them opportunity to also um, take advantage of this Krishna Consciousness Movement. Hare Krishna.